in this video I'm going to explain how to create a virtual machine to install the Windows 2022 operating system so I in previous video I explained how to in, how to download and install the VMware workstation so select the create new work new virtual machine option I choose typical uh, it shows uh, two options one is typical which is recommended one and second one is custom advanced mode and I choose typical and click on next and I will install the operating system later I choose this option to install the operating system later click next and I'm going the guest operating system will be the Windows operating system so I choose Windows and by default it's selected 2022 operating system click on next and VMware machine name I leave it as it is Windows Server 2022 and the location um, instead of C drive I have space in D drive so I select a folder which I have created already and the program files VM and I have a folder Windows Win 2022 I choose that folder click on next and the disk space by default it took 60 GB I don't want to change that and the uh, uh, virtual machine will be split into multiple files that would be the default option so splitting it make it easier to move the virtual machine to another computer but reduce the performance with very large disk uh, I have a space in D drive so I don't want to split it I need a single file so I choose store virtual disk as a single file I click on next so if you want you can click on customize the hardware by default it taken the uh, details what we provided like Windows name Windows Server 2022 and the location and our D drive program files VM win 2022 version operating system detail hard disk space memory network adapter detail and CPU I give finished of the virtual machine created for Windows Server 2022 uh, before that I choose the uh, installation medium okay, I think. Okay. double click on uh, that means power on the virtual machine go to go to home cannot connect that's okay so. yeah so power on and uh, click on the virtual machine go to VM and removable disk here the CD drive is not configured I choose the settings CD drive CD DVD SATA settings and here I mount the ISO image I have that ISO image in D drive Windows 2023 sorry 22 so I choose that ISO image and click on OK now again rest close and restart the VM yes I want to power it off now again open power on the VM click OK now it boot the Windows operating system from from the virtual uh, DVD drive you should click on when it goes dotted line you need to click on enter button so that that will boot the operating system from DVD virtual DVD so 
So now it's loading the operating system from DVD. Allow some time to load the operating system and start the installation. I choose the English language. Click on next. Install now. And it shows the flavors like Windows 2022 standard data center. I choose the second one with the desktop experience means it will install GUI if you choose the first one it will be uh, like command uh, prompt and we, you can use the PowerShell script for administration purpose so now I choose desktop experience click on next for graphical user interfacing so I not upgrade I choose customize in 60 GB space I click on next to install on that virtual disk and allow some time to complete the installation so it start now getting files ready for installation so allow some time to complete the installation setup has been completed and uh, it restarted the virtual machine now it opening the operating system so by default it taken the administrator username and I'm setting the password click on finish to complete the installation press control delete and provide the password Yes, I want access for the network. I give yes. So now that's our operating system is ready. So in the next video, I explain how to add the roles and features for this server. Now it is a standard server. Uh, with operating system 2022 but there is no roles or features for this server in next video I explain how to add the role and feature for this oper uh, server operating system thank you for watching the video thanks for your support